Hi everyone! Just a heads up for this assignment, you're going to be seeing my hands and not just my face, but I wanted to come on and say hello, and I hope that we are ready to roll for our first assignment. So, let's get drawing! So after watching the video, we've noticed that a circle tends to mean that you are friendly. A square tends to mean that you are reliable, you can count on them. Um, they're sturdy. A triangle can emphasize motion or action. And that's based off of the points, the way that it is. So like a zigzag line would also mean action. A strong, stable, straight lines, those mean sturdy. And wavy can also mean friendly. So keep that in mind when you start drawing your character. So I'm going to start drawing mine. And that's what we're going to do for the first time. We are going to be making these into a comic. But for this first lesson, we need to think about what we want our person to be like. So I want mine to be friendly. So I'm going to give them a more rounded shape. Like this. And I want mine to be kind of sturdy, somebody that you can rely on. So I think my body shape is going to be a little bit more square. Even breaking down the arms into kind of some squares just so that I really get the picture across but I want my person to be pretty fast so I'm gonna give them some kind of diagonal legs that are kind of if I draw my primitive, my basic shape, they are triangles. You see that? So I think this is going to be my basic shape for my person. My character. And so I'm going to start drawing in some hands. I'm going to only give them four fingers. Uh-oh, ran out of space over here, that's okay. So I've got my four fingers. I am going to give them maybe just a little bit of a kind of crazy hairstyle to kind of say, hey, they might not have everything under wraps. And I think there's something just friendly and lovable about a unibrow. Those nice round shapes showing that they are somebody that you can trust. And then I'm going to give them some big old eyes here. Mm, maybe a nice big nose. And I'm going to have them smiling. but no teeth. I don't know why, I just really am not feeling teeth here. Here we go, so I've made the basic shape of my character. I wanted my character to be friendly, sturdy, the hair showing a little bit, a little bit crazy. And there we go, I've got my basic shape. So what I can do with this basic shape, because of me, I used a marker and I can't really do a whole lot with it. I can grab a second piece of paper and I can put it right over the top and kind of draw in the basic shapes. So thanks to the copy paper and using a marker, I can see through to get my character drawn out again. 
drawing it with pencil really gives you the option and the ability to play around, to add things, to get rid of things, to see what works for you. So as I'm finishing this up, I just want to talk about what we should have ready for our next art class. We should have our character fully designed. So we've got their hair done, their body done. You could have their clothes done too if you would like. At least have their body shape done, their hair, their face, arms, legs, and all of that wonderful stuff. So I can't wait to start next week where we create our scenes for our characters. See you later.